Every little thing she does is magic Everything she do just turn me on Even though my life before was tragic Now I know my love for her goes on Do I have to tell the story Of a thousand rainy days since we first met It's a big enough umbrella But it's always me that ends up getting wet Every little thing she does is magic Everything she do just turn me on Even though my life before was tragic Now I know my love for her goes on I resolve to call her up A thousand times a day And ask her if she'll marry me In some old fashioned way But my silent fears have gripped me Long before I reach Long before my tongue has tripped me Must I always be alone Every little thing she does is magic Everything she do just turn me on Even though my life before was tragic Now I know my love for her goes on Every little thing she does is magic Everything she do just turn me on Even though my life before was tragic She Does Is Magic by The Police, and I played it straight from the charts of the Morristown Uke Jam. So take the link in the video description, download the free ukulele song sheet, grab your own ukulele, and you can play right along with this video. And if you'll be anywhere near Morristown, New Jersey, come out and play with us. Uh, now in just a moment, I'll do a basic tutorial covering everything I just played. At the very end, I'll do a slow motion close-up play along that you might find helpful, but right now, uh, if you like the video, please like the video with a thumbs up. If you want lots more, uh, check out our, or subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want hundreds more free downloadable ukulele song sheets, each one with a link to its own free video tutorial and play along just like this one, then check out our Dropbox and then come play with us. All right, now this is not an easy song the way I played it. It's, it doesn't have that many chords. It's not that hard. I played it in a kind of a difficult fashion because I wanted to retain as much as possible some of the coolness of the original ultra cool song. I love this song. I do. And there were certain things I heard in the song I wanted to retain. So I'm going to explain now why I made it harder than necessary. You don't have to. If you don't want to work this hard, when you see a G, just play a G. I have three versions of G in this song. Now one of them is kind of a normal thing that I do when I'm playing up the neck. I have a little superscripted number in exactly the same color as the chord that shows you that I'm playing a higher version. So like this is a G, this is a second position G, this is a third position, fourth, fifth, right? It's They're all Gs. You can just play a G and you're fine. That's the normal thing. And yes, I do that. But in this song, I also have a bright red superscripted three after the G sometimes, and that means that I don't play all the strings. It means that I only play the three strings closest to the ceiling. Here's why. 
I wanted to be able to hear this. Though I've tried so hard to tell, before I tell her of the feelings, sorry, tried so hard to tell her of the feelings I have for her in my heart. I wanted to hear that. Well, that is in the G, but I didn't want it to go. I wanted to go. So I did something weird. I used my pinky. I held on to the bottom string. You hear that? What's the highest? That's the highest note you hear, right? you don't have to do that if you don't want to but that's how I got that sound and then that dramatic I wanted to hear I wanted to hear that lead right so I did a second position D instead of the normal D and then I dropped I left this barred second position G and then I just slid up two frets, that's an A. And back down to it. That's how I did it. You can do it with the lowest chords, but it'll sound like this. It's the right chords, but it doesn't have the panache, does it? So you, could, you can play that, you can strive for the Right? Practice that, you'll get it. All right. I just wanted to explain why I made it harder than necessary. That's why. Because the song is so cool, I wanted to be able to play it with as much coolness as I could. Okay, now, uh, let me say this. The right hand, for most of the song, for all the song except for the chorus, uh, which is to say the intro and the verses and the bridge as well, um, the it's kind of a front beat strum. I'm just gonna play a G. Like this. A backbeat would be the emphasis is on the second and fourth. That's a backbeat, right? This is a front beat. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. That's the that's the emphasis. Um, so that's the emphasis of the strum. I've tried before to tell her of the feelings I have for her. Right? With no pauses. That's what I'm doing. But then, that line at the end of the verse, I don't know how to describe that other than if you can hear it, keep your hand moving. You don't, you're not going to do, you're not going to try to, you're not going to try to do that. Keep your hand moving and then down, down, up, down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, down. Oh well. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this slow five times slow. You can watch my hand and practice with me. Just that. I'm just gonna do that line. Starting with that D. Here it goes. Five, six, seven, and And a second time. Play along with me. This is the fourth time. Thank God it's the last time. Okay, and then the chorus has a bit of an odd uh, timing too. Every little thing she does is magic. The emphasis, I'm gonna say, is on the syllables that have the emphasis. If you know the song, even if you're not singing along, if you can picture Sting singing it, 
Every little thing she does is magic. Everything she do just turn me on. Oh, actually, that's, uh, well, whatever, yes. Thing she does is magic. So you see, the magic is actually on an upswing. But that's where the emphasis is. Every, every little thing she does is magic. Everything she do just turn me on. Even though my life before was tragic. How about that? It's down, down, up, up. chord transitions. So I start with a G. All right, oops, falling off here. Start with a G. Again, I'm holding my pinky, but your left hand, I've just formed the whole G, of course. That's the idea. I'm going back and forth from G to A, back to a G, and then a second position G, A rather. Sorry, so I've got a three string G, and then a full A, and then a full G, and then I drop my pinky to make it a second position A. So you can hear. That's the idea. And that whole time, you notice my index finger is just sliding back and forth. It never picks up off the ukulele. It just slides back and forth. That's your stability factor there. Right, and same thing through uh, through most of the verse as well. Three quarters of the verse is tried before to tell her feelings of okay. And now from that A, or sorry, from that A, my pinky is all the way up here already. I'm just gonna slide it one more fret up. My index finger is gonna bar that second fret. Now I'm going to drop two more fingers down for that G. Slide up two frets. Same position exactly, just two frets up. So. That's it. And then with the chorus, easy, easy, you've got your A. Every little thing she does is magic. I'm just dropping the D. I don't even bother to pick up my index finger because I'm just going back and forth, right there. That's all I have to do. And she does is magic. Everything she do turn me on. Even though my life before was tragic, now my love, my love for her goes. And now I'm gonna slide my index finger over, so I've got that B flat. Um, now I'm gonna just roll my index finger up so it only covers the second string from the floor. And then I go right back to my G A G A. And that's it. Now the uh, the bridge is has a little bit different. I gotta push this up so I can see that. There we go. The bridge is a little bit funky. I go from the B flat. I move my middle finger over one fret or one uh, string rather and I've got my A minor right so and then I lay down three of the strings of the B flat that's what that G minor is it's just the same three strings I just leave my ring finger up and back to the A minor again and then G minor 7 A minor flat A minor. and that so I'm just going back and forth between those right And then B flat to a C. My pinky is kind of hovering right over the C anyway, so. But my silent fears have gripped me long before I reach the phone. Long before my tongue has tripped me, must I always be alone? And it's a shortened version of that same. And then that's it, pretty much. Uh, the rest of it is variations on that through the end of the song. I think now I'm gonna do slow motion. I think I'm just gonna go from through the intro uh, to the first chorus. Slow motion, close up. I'm gonna do this time, close up on both hands. You don't have to see my face, but you might wanna see where I'm holding on to 
that string. So here goes. Slow motion. I'm shaping a G, but I'm holding on to my first string from the floor. Slow motion. Five, six, seven, and... Sorry, though I, I was singing the wrong key. Let's start over again. Five, six, seven, and. See you Wednesday. Bye.